Hello everyone, in this video I will explain you how to sum the values in an array or you can say how to sum the elements in an array. So uh, this is used to in some scenarios like uh, when you want to add the employee salaries uh, of a company or in some scenarios like if you want to add the sales of a product in for a month or for a year. In like uh, that scenarios you can use this uh, sum method so let me show you uh, what is array so array is a set of elements and array variable is a type of variable which enables you to store multiple values of same data type like this if you want to uh, add an array of strings you can add only strings and you can't add int in this array okay so index index is nothing but which starts from zero and in this example zero is the index of this values john and one is the index of this value smith and similarly three is an index of this um, value ankit so with the help of this index values uh, you can access their with the help of this index numbers you can access their values and write them okay so in our task i am going to add employee salaries and show you how to use some method in uipath so let's go to uipath studio and I'm going to add assign activity into our designer panel and I will create a array variable and I'm going to name it as employee salaries because I'm going to add employee salaries so employee salary okay so I'm going to give some values in this field let me open in advanced editor and i will copy the values from my document so i will copy from this here and paste okay so here are five values and i'm going to sum all these values so these are the salaries of employees and click on ok and i'm going to change its variable type to array of int okay so click on this drop down and click on this array of t t is nothing but type and array of int okay so click on ok and i'm going to use message box activity or I can use write line activity to display the output so write line and let me give variable, array variable name employee salary dot I will use this predefined sum method and I will convert this to to string ok so let me show you in advanced editor so array variable name and predefined sum method and I have converted this to to string because this write line activity displays the output in text banner okay so let me run the code so look at the output panel you got the sum as 140,000 rupees okay so which adds all the employee salaries and it is displaying the output in this right line activity at output panel okay so this is how to use uh, some method in AI path thanks for watching please do subscribe and like to my video if you like the video